All right, got a scratch belt for me. 2D takeoff, wind is about 10 to 15 miles per hour, gust to 20. Increased uh, heading hole gain. Yeah. Elevator uh, gain and also, what else? Y'all. Here we go. Still 2D mode. Oh, the wind's really kicking up now. Flying like a kite. Maintaining heading. It's got a lot of rudder. You can actually see the rudder. Glad I kicked that up. Now it's in 3D with heading hold. Okay, increasing, increasing the uh, pitch really helped because this thing ballooned before. Back to 2D. You saw it fall out of the 2D mode, out of the climb. Must have max, everybody reached the max angle, which is like 60. It needed more gain. Had more yaw and more elevator or pitch. Because the rudder on this is huge, I didn't have enough gain built into it. And the wind keeps changing now, it's out of the, at my back. It took off, it was my front going from my right to my left. 3D. Let's go up and roll it. Heading hold, 3D mode with the increased yaw. And pitch, much better in the wind. You pop right back. Boy, I'm glad I'm flying using these inexpensive scratch bills. Only already crashed, crashed this once screwing around with it. A minute left. Nice and level, you can see the 
ailerons and ele elevons. Getting a nice workout. Level under power. Yeah, let's bring her in. If we can. Now we're in kite mode. I want to see a string attached to it. Now the wind's over my right shoulder, heading due north. So the plane's flying into the wind. Nice slow descent, power at one third, power off, glide. Very nice. And 20 seconds left. Well, I like that. That saved that setting. This is perfect for that plane with the wind switching around. Now it's calm. Down here, see over those trees. You can see it's blowing pretty good, say 10 to 15 miles per hour now.